<laughs> What's up, Zandu Nation? It's hot as balls. It's hot as balls. It's hot as balls. My balls are hot. I'm sweating everywhere, and it's not fun. What's up, players? What's going on, Zendu Nation? A couple things. We're here in lovely Austin, Texas, a place where Brandon and I both used to live, and where Zen Dude Fitness was actually created. So, I'm very excited to be here today. We're on the road. This is a travel workout. We're proving to you guys that you can bring the gym with you anywhere you go by just having a jump rope and your body. So guys, we're gonna keep it simple and do a 20 minute Tabata workout that's gonna focus on a little bit of lower body and then six jump rope exercises. If you want a gym that you can bring with you anywhere, we linked up our favorite jump rope in the first line of the, the description, and it's also the rope that we use in this video. Don't be silly, guys. If you're out in the heat and you're not hydrated, you're probably gonna pass out and it's gonna feel really bad. Be careful, make sure that you're hydrated. Don't pass out. All right, Zendu Nation. Let's go. Starting off boxer skip, guys. Everything you got, I want full on intensity. If you'll notice, I am already sweating profusely. That's a good thing. You wanna go at your max intensity so you don't have to work out for a long time. Get it in and get done, guys. We got 10 seconds of rest here coming up. And thank you to the YouTube community. Thank you to the YouTube community, guys, for putting a suggestion in to change the music so that you guys know when the rest time is. Um, I also put in when the next exercise is gonna be for these workouts, too. Now we got regular bounce and side swipe. So pretend there's two people standing on either side of me. I'm spinning the rope around myself in the middle, then over the guy on the right side, then over the guy on the left side. And I'm just doing three motions. If you haven't, check out our tutorial on this move and jump rope like a pro. Uh. Side squat taps, guys, here we go. So we're squatting down in the middle, and then when we come up, I'm using that momentum to tap my feet out to the side, but I'm not putting my weight out there. I'm just tapping my feet as my weight is still coming up in the air. Good, guys. Jump, rope, mummy, kicks, let's go! Here you go guys, up on the toes and you're just kicking the feet slightly out, slightly out. See how my upper body is all regular bounce kind of motion? My feet are going out to the front, out to the front. Good, good, good. Let's go, come on guys, pick it up. Jump rope crisscross, jump rope crisscross. If you haven't, check out our tutorial on the crisscross, okay? And if you cannot do these advanced moves, guys, that is totally fine. What I want you to do instead is just regular bounce or boxer skip. Squat pulse next, last body weight exercise. Let's go, ladies and gentlemen. Good, here we go. Squat pulse. So I'm coming down below 90 degrees, I'm squatting the whole way down, but as I turn to the side here in a sec, you'll see when I come back up, I'm letting the weight of my feet stay on my heels, and I'm not, I'm not straightening my legs out fully, I'm just kind of bending them and pulsing up and down. Jump rope butt kicks next. Butt kicks, butt kicks, fire them, fire them. Make sure you're getting them the whole way up there. Heel has to go the whole way to the butt, whole way to the butt. Last one, guys, before you repeat this circuit another four times. Rest a minute in between and repeat it four more times for a total of five. Workout's about 20 to 30 minutes, super short. Actually, it's about 24, 25 if you factor in the rest times between each circuit. But running in place crisscross, guys. 
that's all for now zendu nation way to get after it today guys we will see you on the next high intensity workout